So here's the rules. We'll be grading each spot on taste, value, and customer service. And customer service is gonna be interesting because frankly, I wouldn't be giving service with a smile at 3 a.m. The top three spots will receive these handmade, spectacular, incredible, amazing trophies. And I think number one will be Taco Bell. I think number one's gonna be IHOP. First up, we might as well do McDonald's because we're here and they've been watching me embarrassingly trying to film my intro for the last half hour. This is honestly gonna be such a challenge for me because I literally go to bed at 9 p.m. I'll get a McDouble and fries, a large shamrock shake, another medium fry. There's just like a person outside our window. I'm gonna pull up. I'm so Dude, I don't, I don't want her to jump in front of my car though. I'm going. I'm going. Things we didn't consider is how dangerous it might be to do this after midnight. Hi, sorry. There's just like a person standing outside our window. Yeah, sorry. That's okay. Oh, no, it's okay. I hope it's a lot. As long as it's not like it doesn't endanger you. Dude, customer service, 12 out of 10. She deserves a cookie. Fry. Delicious. Wow. That looks beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so Have much. Have a good night. Have a good night. Why was that the most beautiful, nicest human in the whole entire world? Wait, why are they nicer than the daytime workers? No, That's so cute. I swear to God, the daytime workers like spit on you. McDonald's. Customer service is already a 15 out of 10. That's delicious. I genuinely do think fast food tastes better after midnight. Something about that greasy food soaking up in your tummy. In the last video, it's almost good. You didn't rank as high as you're gonna rank today, baby, because right now I am giving you, what am I giving you? Oh my God, am I not as funny and witty at night? I can't think of anything. A shook out of 10. A shooketh in a good way. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Shooketh in a good way. Next up, we have Taco Bell. This is Miss Girl. Top things people probably know about me. I have really cute dogs. I used to own ducks. And I love Taco Bell. But I think it tastes best late at night. Hi, can I get two spicy potato tacos with no lettuce? And then a large baja blast. The Cinnabon Delights. Oh, the Cinnabon Delights. Oh, the Chalupa. Why is everyone nice? Why is everyone so nice? We literally thought that we were gonna get like killed. You're gonna piss your pants at the Cinnabon Delights. Have you ever had them? Yeah. Uh oh. I've missed you. A little burnt. So what you're saying is it's worse at night. This can't be. The yeah. spicy potato taco. I feel like we should also mention whatever food we don't finish, I'm literally bringing home to justice and we're just gonna have as leftovers. But dude, I can't stop eating, it's so yummy. Those came right out of the whatever that they're made in. The fryer. Oh. Value, 10 out of 10. Talk about your prices know what they're talking about. Taste, 8.2 out of three things were incredible. Customer service, 10 out of 10. Talk about, I will say, I don't think it hit better after midnight. I genuinely do think fast food tastes better after midnight. On the Lexi scale, I think we're gonna go ahead and give this a simple smiley out of 10. Boba? When does Jack in the Box sell boba? Hello? Can I get a large curly fry? The tiny taco, a boba drink? Do you have the French toast sticks right now? Yeah. We'll take those as well. Don't worry. I wear sweatpants. Jack, Jack in the, in the box. box. I'm full. It's a little blend. They're also kind of dry. How are they dry? Well, it took us 20 minutes to get our food. They must be fresh. Oh, here's the French toast sticks. It kind of just tastes like air. Tiny, Tiny tacos. tacos. It tastes like burnt and bad. Jack in the box, iced coffee boba. I already feel like I'm gonna vomit. <laughs> no one respects my emetophobia. <laughs> Value, seven out of 10, because frankly, I want my money back. Taste, I'm gonna go with three out of 10. Those were some of the worst food items I've ever had. Customer service, nine out of 10. She was lovely. Overall, what the heck out of 10? This is so upsetting. The only reason I ever come to Wendy's is for a Frosty. You know what I think they also have? I think they have grilled cheese. Okay, how can I help you? Uh, do you have grilled cheese? Grilled cheese, no. Um, I'll get a small fry and then a chocolate Frosty. Some nuggets. Some nuggets? Regular or spicy? Spicy, spicy always. Spicy nuggets. Ooh, is the Frosty Cream Cold Brew good? Uh, it, it's okay, it's, uh, it's our iced coffee. You know what, I'll skip that. Here's I'm sad. Have y'all ever heard <laughs> of salt? <laughs> Whoa. Hard to go wrong with Frosty though. I guess I won't be trying it because you just linked the entire I feel like we started off so strong and now we're just kind of going like this. 
and it's not going well. And I'd like it to start going well again because I don't want to keep eating unsalted fries. Straight up F out of 10. You have failed this class. Not the sign that says new fiery big fish sandwich. That's all you girl. Babe, we have to tell them. We have to tell them if it's good and if they should order it. I don't think anyone's ordering it. Hey, um, can I get the big fish fiery sandwich? Mozzarella sticks. Thank you so much. You're welcome. He gave me a coupon. Thank you. She's her boss, you can't hit her. <laughs> the truth comes out at night. Look at that cheese ball. It doesn't suck. A lot of the food has lost flavor tonight. You're so brave. She's well behaved. Okay. She is not afraid. That's pretty good. Yeah? Not spicy. I'm gonna say I'm mediocrely impressed. Lexi scale. Value, I'd say eight. You're a little overpriced, Kruger Bing, especially for a fast food restaurant that I frequently forget exists. Taste, seven. It wasn't great, but it wasn't horrible. Customer service, I'd give a nine. He was really nice. He was really nice. You just couldn't hear us. That's Kruger Bing's fault. That's Kruger Bing. Overall, I wouldn't come back out of 10. Is, Carl's Jr. Is anyone's favorite restaurant Carl's Jr.? I think the girl with the pug who was like, you can take a small bite. Maybe it's theirs. Can I please get the chicken star and the waffle fries? There's a sign on the window that says that they're collecting our data. We're collecting theirs. Carl's, Carl's Jr. Jr. <laughs> the best food isn't hitting better after midnight. It's hitting worse. Mmm, that's the most flavor I've tasted in an hour. Mmm, just awesome. as dry as I remember. Carl's Jr., taste, 7.5. Value, I don't remember, but let's go with a 9. Customer service, 9. I just like, I feel like no one's gonna live up to the standards that McDonald's set today. Everyone says there's caffeine in soda, but it doesn't feel like it. When they say that, like, it's just from the sugar, right? I don't know. I'm not a paleontologist. That would be dinosaurs. Carl's Jr. You're getting an unmemorable out of 10. You know I'm full when I'm not even like excited for In-N-Out. Can I get a cheeseburger, do this meat cheese bun? An animal fry with yes. no onion. Can I do a hot cocoa? Of course, did you want marshmallows at that one? <gasps> yeah. Marshmallows? Oh, I didn't know y'all had malas. <laughs> That's did, thrilling. Did. Would you rather work the late night shift at Carl's Jr. or work for me? <laughs> Carl's Jr. Easy. It sucks because the first guy was so nice. He was so nice. The other, like the girl out the window was not. She told them to speed up and pick up their feet and it wasn't in a nice way. I'm like, like, you guys are slow pokes. Pick up your feet. It's the middle of the night. It's not that deep. It really isn't. No one is running late. Also in front of the customer. I know. Oh. I'm really excited because I always forget that In-N-Out has hot cocoa. Oh my God, it's literally just water. <laughs> it just tastes like water. They just served us water from the Los Angeles River. <laughs> oh. That might be hitting the best. That's better, I feel like, than it is during the day. This might be the best so far. Do you want to try the burger? Dude, I like can't think about meat right now. I'm just so scared. We'll just be at like a nine. Value. Honestly, like 10 out of 10, I feel I feel like it has good value. The prices have barely gone up with inflation. Customer service is a bit iffy because we had a 10 and then we had a four. So should I even that out to like a seven? Poor Matthew, doesn't deserve Matthew that. Matthew deserves better. You know what, I think, I think we should just give the trophy to Matthew. Hi, how are you guys? We wanted to give you this trophy. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Because you were just so nice. Oh, you just you, so you like embody human joy. Oh, I appreciate that. Thank you. And we appreciate you. And the, the mean lady in there, she needs to appreciate you more. <laughs> this is for you. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah. Much love. We wish you the best of luck with the rest of your shift. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Of course. <laughs> Yo. Guys, this is my personal end and now I can never come here again. <laughs> Who was mean to them inside? Guys, I'm so upset. Why did I say that? Oh my god, I need out of this line. I'm having an actual panic attack. Um, well, we're at Del Taco. I'm still coming down off of the sadness of how violently embarrassing it was giving that trophy to Matthew. Hi. The shrimp. I'll do the beer battered crispy fish tacos, the hash brown stick, and the donut bites. Del Taco, also known as not as good as Taco Bell. I'm excited because we got some breakfast items. Look at these little hash brown sticks. Aw, cute. Oh. 
Yum. I just wish it was saltier. Try your fish taco. This she made that for you <laughs> with love at two in the morning. It wasn't made with love. It was some tough love, but it was love. I wish the fish was crunchy, but it tastes good. Really it's good not bad flavor? flavor? Yeah, it's good flavor. Is it filled? No. But it's really good. Those are pillows of cinnamon joy. Del Taco? Del Taco. You pleasantly surprised me. Value, 10 out of 10. That ish was cheap. Mm hmm Taste, good. 9 out of 10. That was really good. Those really good. donut holes were delicious. Really? Customer service, like 9 out of 10. Del Taco, I would give you a wow! Out of 10. It's time for our most exciting stop of the night. Starbucks. What am I getting for you today? Um, how many shots of espresso could I do in one drink? Uh, there's no limit, really. Oh. I was, yeah. Can I do like five shots of espresso? The cops are out. They're coming to get you for putting five shots of espresso in your drink. Thank you. Have a yeah. great night. Thank you. Oh. What was <laughs> What did I hit? They were like barricades. <laughs> 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 oh my god. My caramel macchiato with five shots of espresso. Hazelnut shaken espresso with oat milk. Latte. Wow, that's a lot of coffee. Honestly, this is good. This could suck and I would just be so thankful to be drinking it. Value eight, it's a little bit expensive. Taste, nine, honestly, frankly could be better, but right now I'm very thankful for it. And customer service, 10. The speed. Uh, probably a nine. Like, she didn't go like above and beyond, but she was lovely. Well, we'll be right back after this short commercial break, unless Sophia kills me, in which case, we'll not, we won't be back. We'll never be back. According to the signs outside, this is the best Mexican food in Los Angeles. <gasps> that cheese bowl is crazy. Crazy. That's a good cheese quesadilla. Quesadilla. Mmm. Yummy. I love the quesadilla. Yeah. That's good. Would I say the best Mexican food in Los Angeles? No. Maybe not the best Mexican food, but that man had service with a smile, and I loved him. Yeah. Maybe Los Tacos was the friends we made along the way out of 10. All right. <laughs> So Addison has so kindly offered to guest appear and try fat sauce for us, which is way better than last time when he tried Arby's for us. It is thinly sliced ribeye steak, mozzarella sticks, onion rings, fries, brown gravy, mayo on a garlic hero bread. Oh, he's in, he's in. Oh, it smells good. It smells. Oh my God, oh my God. Imagine you've had a night out, maybe one too many drinks. So in that <laughs> scenario, this is a 10. I don't know, it's hectic. <laughs> I'm like on a, a non-drunk scale, I'm gonna give this. I'm gonna give this a seven. No, I'm gonna give it a six. Cause there's just a lot going on. What is this? What shake did you get? It's like a s'mores shake. It's I. I'm feeling like value. This is like a two. Yeah. Because you paid forty dollars for this. I will say they do get extra points for having a bathroom because I haven't peed in about four hours. This place had good vibes. Nice man helped us at the counter. I would say the man working there was the best part of this experience. Yeah. The more I think about it, the more I <laughs> like lower the ranking. <laughs> we are rolling up to Raisin Cane's at a whopping 3.20 a.m. and they close at 3.30. Let's see what kind of service they give us. Fire those grills up, boys. Um, can we get that three finger combo? Yeah. We're bad people. It's We're bad people. Okay. <laughs> because we got her this trophy. It's 10 minutes before they close. I would have just like hidden and like pretended I that I wasn't there. there. You know what, let's just save it for like TSA and put it in our luggage. <laughs> we just wanted to give this to you because you guys are so wonderful. So cute. I and just put oh. ultra toast in there too. <gasps> <gasps> no, you no, are so no, nice. So Thank cute. you for being open so late and I, for giving us our food. Yeah. We appreciate you yeah, so much. Well, there's a bomb. Oh my God. <laughs> Well, have a wonderful night. Thank you so much. Oh no, oh my God, don't worry about it. Oh my God, y'all are so fun. Thank you so much. Have a good night. Love you. Thank God they were nice. I went was so much time. Oh my God, I'm gonna cry. It's too late. It's too late. There's a cat in there. Lexi, Lexi. Lexi. Yeah. They were so insanely nice. It's really late and I get emotional when I'm tired. I can't handle this level of kindness I at can't. this hour. I can't. I want to marry everyone at Raising Team. That was our last drive through. It has been like six hours. What if I was like, oh, the last one?
but we still have one trophy to give out. I think we all know who deserves this trophy tonight. McDonald's. I think they deserve this award. Greatest after midnight. Well, ironically, um, they're now closed. I guess, I guess it's not 24 hours after all. Just leave that there. Thank you.